Welcome to Sport is Performance. I want to give you a little bit of an overview about what's expected. This is an online course for advanced students and we look at performance theory in relation to sport and athletics. There are eight modules as you'll see on the Canvas site. Uh, each one has a Prezi presentation. Uh, which gives you the landscape of the assignment and there are some short readings uh, YouTube videos and website links there's optional readings and you'll see under canvas that I've divided that up into very clear sections uh, there's also fun stuff uh, which I've put there uh, there are no books for the course uh, uh, but there are optional readings and uh, bibliography if you want to learn more. The uh, objective, as I said, is to use uh, foundational concepts in performance theory as applied to sport. So we'll begin by defining sport taken from a sociological and anthropological perspective uh, to discover, and we'll discover key aspects of performance theory among the topics we'll uh, consider ritual in American football and the Trobriand Islanders cricket, uh, performing bodies, preparation, practice, rehearsal, biomechanics, semiotics of team mascots, nicknames, and logos. That means the uh, sign function, the communication function, the symbolic function of mascots. We look at the stadium and the stage. Uh, we talk about athletes being able to perform uh, on the top stages uh, when they can win the playoffs, for instance, on the big stage. Uh, we'll consider feminism, gender, race. Uh, professional wrestling uh, and you'll do some discussions which involve social media uh, looking at an event uh, attending an event uh, interviewing an athlete and a performer uh, and look again the social media you'd look at how professional athletes uh, uh, construct their gender on uh, on social media sites. So at the end of the course you will be knowledgeable in theories of performance and be able to interrogate spectacles of sport to explore aspects of physical action, audience response, and the nature of the performance event in sport and art. Uh, so the overall objective is how to apply performance theory, how it can uh, enhance our understanding and appreciation of both. The requirements, in addition to the discussions, there'll be four short quizzes, one on each two modules, and I will give you study guides for the quizzes uh, and, uh, and rubrics for the reports. All right. Um, welcome, and I hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, uh, send me a note on Canvas. Thank you.